The trailhead for the Yodelin Ski Tour is located just east of Stevens Pass Ski Area on the site of an abandoned smaller ski area that last operated in the 1960s. You'll see the remnants of the ski runs and some structures along the tour route as you make your way up the ridge to the main descents of this tour. The tour is truly a yo-yo tour. Plan on three to four trips up and down the slopes to make good use of the terrain that is available. The beauty of this tour is the ease of access and the stability of the snow. Route finding is important as if you miss the terrain landmarks you could run into trouble finding your way back to the parking lot. To begin the tour, start at the Yodelin parking lot on the south side of Stevens Pass Highway, about 1.6 miles east of Stevens Pass Summit. Facing up the slope, cross over a small open glade just above the west side of the parking lot and find a small trail that leads to a road that switchbacks up the slope. After a switchback on the road, you will head eastward along the north slope into another open glade at the base of what is the upper runs of the old Yodelin ski area. Traverse eastward again through a strip of dense woods up to the ridge crest and you'll find a slope with scattered trees that are repopulating the old runs. Let's explore the descent options. The ridge area is the prime area for yo-yoing the slopes and getting in your turns on a good north-facing slope. The snow can be excellent here in the sparse trees if you hit the conditions right. There are two parallel runs on the north side, the easterly one being much lower angled, but with an option for a steeper pitch at the top of the run. Ski these northerly runs down to the lower flats to get the most out of your climbing. If the snow is deep and soft in the trees, there is a wide section of well-spaced trees that begins higher up on the ridge in the easterly direction. Climb above the open runs and traverse the ridge for 5 to 15 minutes and turn north to check out the tree runs. These runs are moderately steep and good tree skiing skills and a partner are needed. Ski north down the slope until you cross the first road cut. After that road cut, head north and west to reach the lower road cut. Stop there and head back west up the road to the base of the open runs we saw earlier. When you have skied out the snow, traverse back to the west through the trees at the base of the north runs and you'll find your up track and the road that brings you back to the parking lot. The western descent route starts by heading southwest along the crest of the ridge for about 100 meters, then head directly west down through a short segment of medium density forest, and then through a larger open glade that converges with your up track. Here again, you follow the abandoned road back to the parking lot to finish the tour.